So let's talk about national anthems and uh, what they represent. So um, generally, it's common knowledge that a country's national anthem really plays an important role both within its borders and also at the international level. And just like the national flag, a country's national anthem is meant to represent, you know, the national pride as well as its unique identity. The sense of national pride extends even to the international levels when you're talking about uh, maybe when we play our national anthem when uh, we have a player at the Olympics. And uh, this is just in their honor. So there are actually countries whose national anthems have no known lyrics. And that was what I wanted to present to you for our insight today. But then I thought like just mentioning the uh, countries wouldn't be enough. So uh, when you're looking at these countries, according to the research I've done, there are actually four. So uh, we have the commonest one is uh, Spain. And then we also have Bosnia and uh, Herzegovina. We have San Marino and another one is Kosovo. So while trying to look at why these countries have no lyrics on their anthems, it's not like they are not actually there. It's only that um, there are no official non-lyrics for them. The composers of the same presented a lyrics. It's only that none of them was actually uh, accepted officially. I went ahead to look at the history of the Spanish um, Guys, help me with the pronunciation of this word. Well, at first I thought it's the Macharial, but looking at the YouTube pronunciation, it's supposed to be Macharil, something of the sort. You tell me, how is it supposed to be pronounced? Okay, so let's do with the Macharil for now. It has had different composers, like I forementioned. And uh, looking at those ones also, different composers gave different lyrics for the same. It's only that uh, none of those was officially adopted by the government. But looking at the current version uh, of the Macha Reel, um, normally there are no lyrics, but um, the presentation comprises uh, orchestration. Um, there is a playing of the organ and other musical instruments okay and uh, the current version of the marcha reel was composed uh, or rather was purchased sorry by the spanish government in accordance with the royal decree on october 10th 1997 according to the royal decree it established that the 52 seconds long anthem must be played in b flat major with a tempo rate of 76 bpm i don't really understand what those things mean uh, but uh, perhaps the people um who love music can tell us. But uh, the modern material is made up of a 16 bar face that is divided into two sections that are both composed of four repeated bars. Again, I don't know what that is. But then what is important is that um, they are presently two main versions of the material and each one of them is meant to be... Uh, it's, it's meant to serve a specific purpose. So, for example, the lengthier version of the same is uh, exclusively used to honor the king, and the shorter version is played at sporting events as well as uh, for Spain's president and other dignitaries. Okay, and also uh, what is important to note is that uh, the anthem has three arrangements that are to be played by orchestras, military bands, and the organ. And uh, for the purpose of avoiding copyright issues, the government bought all the rights of the Masha Reel. <laughs> from uh, somebody called Perez Casas and uh, that went for a total of 130 million and uh, during the early 20th century it was Casas, uh, Perez Casas who was responsible for writing the anthem's harmonization but presently the Macha Reel is owned by Spain's Ministry of Culture and it charges uh, copyright fees for its usage so sorry for a lot of uh, nonsensical information but the main idea here is that um these particular countries have no known lyrics not really because they're uh, they're not there but it's because um none of those ones that were presented were nationally accepted or rather none of them was made official so that is for our insight today until next time it's bye for now